Hey guys, once again we got Bella, sweetest ever Papillon. Here she is with us again. Um, in today's video we're going to show you uh, a little bit of a how-to on Bella. Bella has um, weak back legs, um, so she doesn't, she can't stand real well. Um, so we're going to, I'm going to show you a little technique that I use to help her uh, with that, with uh, shaving her, her rear. Okay, guys, now that Bella's on the table, um, as you can see, she sits a lot. So anytime we go to stand Bella up, um, see, she, she's very weak in her back leg, so she goes to sit down a lot. You see how she's favoring this leg? All right, so we have to clip her butt. So this could be a little bit of a challenge. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you what I do um, to help her stand. What we have is a 30 blade with a number four snap-on comb um, that we're going to use initially. And I'm going to show you what I do. I, I simply lift her up and support her. And then I'm going to put my arm underneath her so there's no pressure on her legs. Now she can stand. So I'm just, she's kind of cradled right into my elbow. And I'm going to grab her tail with my hand like this and now I can clip her rear, you see, without having her stand on her own. I'm, I'm completely supporting all of her weight so she doesn't have to stand at all. Uh, even in doing this though, I'm still going to give her a little break and have her sit, sit down again. Just to give her a little break. Um, because again, we just, oh, Bill, I love you, Mama. Good girl, you're such a good girl, right? <laughs> good girly. Okay, so we're gonna give her a little break. <laughs> you cook. Bella is very used to doing this too. She's used to my technique, so um, she kind of tries to help as well. Uh, but I'm gonna switch blades real quick, and I'm gonna put my ten blade on so that I can get it a little bit closer than the four blue combs. So once again, we're picking her up, putting the arm under her, and just having her cradle. And now I can work on her butt, just like this. And we can clip her little, her, little, her little butt area there. Okay. So, now the other challenging part is you know, we have to get in between her legs here. So just kind of separating her legs like this and just getting in there with the 10 blade, making a little V out of the 10 blade here with the 10 blade. We can clear that out. Okay, so notice right in here how we're creating a little bit of a, a V here, um, just clearing out. See that on that side? I'm just going to switch over and get all this crud out. See all that coming out? And, you know, a lot of that is just you know her, you know her urine or kind of sticking to the fur. You see how we're clearing all that out? like that. Okay guys, so once again you can see how easy uh, we did that um, and we're going to show you the finish too but we're going to let her sit again and even when you put her down I like to let her down very very gently so she's not slamming back onto the table but um, it's a very very simple technique. Uh, any dog that has, you know, any small dog you, you, you would struggle to do that with a larger breed dog but with any smaller breed dog that's suffering from any uh, rear hip problems or leg problems. Uh, just a very, very simple technique. That's one of the many ways. We're going to show you a lot of different ways. But um, just with Bella in particular, uh, we've gotten her used to that process of, uh, you know, just simply it's, it's, it's a sit. Even when you lift them, though, you have to be careful even on the, the initial lift. You want to support her. Um, I kind of I kind of lift her whole without putting pressure on her hips, especially this left one, because I know that this is the one that she favors. So I'm not really grabbing her by her hip. I'm grabbing her by her torso and just kind of helping her up, and then quickly get your arm underneath like that, and it'll it'll allow you to work on her rear 
um, again without without having her stand. Okay, guys, um, we uh, we prepped and bathed Bella, so she's all ready for the finish. And like we said, we're just going to go over her her butt again. Um, same same procedure. We're just going to lift her up carefully and do the same hold as we did before. Okay, and we're going to just move the tail like before. Now that the, the hair's a lot cleaner, uh, it'll come off a little better. But you see, she's struggling a little bit, so I'm actually going to let her sit for a sec um, and just restart her because she's kind of just struggling on that a little bit. So we're just going to let her sit for one second. Good girl, Bells. Good girl, Mama. You my baby? Hmm? You almost done. And we're just going to do it again, okay? Just once again, we're going to lift her. Let her rest. And just kind of clip out any excess hair. Again, just forming that little V. So it cleared out. It's okay, guys. It's okay. Okay, okay, okay. Good girl. Good girl, mama. You're almost done. You're almost done, mama. I know. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> You're too baby. I know. You're almost done. I just want to do one little thing. A little bit more and you're done, Mama. Yeah, I keep, if you notice, I keep combing through um, because as, as you cut the hair, a lot of it just get, falls into the tail. So I'm just trying to clear that out. Okay, Bells. One more time and that's it. And we're just going to give you a break. Okay, here we go. Okay. All right. We're just going to call it there because as you can see, it's towards the end of the grooming. She's actually done a lot of standing <coughs> for us because she tries so hard to, uh, to help me uh, groom her. So, um, you know, we're just going to give her a break. We got it really good anyway. Uh, get our spray. Cover her eyes. Good girl, Bells. Good girl, Bells. Let me see you. Look at you. You're so pretty. Bella's oh, so pretty. She's so pretty. Now, even when I when I do the finish here with the spray, um, I'm gonna kind of. That's just a finishing spray, by the way. Um, I'm just gonna do the lift again, just to work the uh, the spray into. The, 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 the rear again. So I'm just going to give her her little lift again real quick. Brush out any excess. Just set her down again. Good girl, Bells. She's so pretty. What, what you doing? What you doing, Bella? Hmm? We did her ears. Um, conditioner. Good girl, Bells. That's all, Mama. That's it, baby. You did it. You did it. That's all, Bella. Sweetest Pappy on ever. That's it. Bella's all done. There she is. Another successful grooming. Such a good dog that Bella is. You know. But yeah, just simple techniques like that will just make the grooming go a little bit easier uh, for the dog and yourself. You know, just uh, have to kind of figure out what what might work. And like like we always say, we might approach a, a, another dog in a different way. But Bella's used to me doing that, so um, you know she just allows it. And if you just do it the same way all the time, they get used to it and they actually try to help it along, just like Bella did there. Right, Bells? You a good girl, Mama? Give me kisses. No? No kisses? Not this time? Okay. Well, anyway, guys, uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe uh, so that we can show you a lot more tips. So give it up for Bella once again. Sweetest Papi on the You don't like me no more? Aw, oh, thank you, Bella. <laughs> thank you, Mama.